All right. Been a little while. I took a little bit of a break from Disgaea, and, uh, well, I guess we're coming back. So this one's Disgaea PC. I actually have no idea if this is going to be any good. I heard some kind of bad things about the, the port. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, I'm also kind of confused. I wonder if Etna mode exists or not in this game. Uh, this is this is the PC port of Disgaea Afternoon of Darkness, which is the very first Disgaea game, but they like redid it later with more content, uh, which had like a whole Etna campaign. But I don't know if that exists in this one or not. If it doesn't, then I'm gonna have to pull out an emulator or something like that to figure out how to connect it, because I'd like to play that one too. Either way though, let's get started. King Kridrefskoy, the mighty ruler of the Netherworld. His long reign came to an abrupt end as the news of his death spread throughout the Dark Land. Ambitious demons rose one after another to seize the opportunity. And thus began the age of turbulence and anarchy. Two years later, Awaken me, the great Laharl. Oh, Prince, I'm glad you're still alive. Who said I was dead? I was just taking a nap. Anyways, why are all those weapons behind you? having a hard time waking you up. Are you sure you weren't trying to kill me instead? No! Uh, I mean, yes. I, I just wanted to wake you up. <laughs> Whatever. So, what is it? You better have a good reason for waking me up. Oh, yeah! Big news. Your father, King Krzyzewskoy, has died. He what? When? Two years ago. Wait a second. So, you're telling me that I've been sleeping for over two years? Yep. Yup? Why didn't you wake me up earlier? Excuse me, but what do you think I've been doing all this time? The Netherworld has gone to hell while you were sleeping. It's not my fault if some other demon steals the title of Overlord. What? Have they forgotten whose title they're trying to steal? <laughs> bold of them. I shall show no mercy, for I am Laharl, the rightful heir to the throne! <laughs> Your humble vassal Etna will accompany you. Episode 1 Prince of the Netherworld. Are you kidding me? I mean, that's just a thing? Okay, V-Sync doesn't do it. Character filter? No. Oh. Oh, God! Character filter just makes them all blurry. Well, I'm gonna keep that off, I guess. Map texture. Well, that fixes that. So apparently, if you want to play this game with the new, with like the new textures and whatnot, it 
screws everything up. It looks awful. Ah. Uh, Jesus Christ. Wow. I, um... Actually speechless. I didn't realize I could be speechless about this game. But... Here we are. Like, the portraits look really nice. Uh... Half of the sprites have their feet cut off. Really? I... Um... Huh. Honestly, guys, I'm just, like, super disappointed. There's, like, zero re- Oh, God. Wait, are you serious? So the- There's a screen end blur that blurs the top and- Why would I have that on? Who designed this? It still does it! I think. Yeah. Maybe that's the ambient occlusion. Let's turn that off, too. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so, um, wow. Wow. So this game got ported to the PC. The port? Useless. And doesn't have Aetna mode. I, I, I don't have words. I don't have words. Honestly, I'd be better off just dusting off my ancient copy and going from there. Fuck it. Can you, like, buy this for, like... The PS3? Like a another HD remake that they made? Alright, whatever. Uh, I can't find any more information. So I'm gonna keep with this, just because, I mean, it wasn't that expensive and I like Disgaea games. And, like, the nice portraits kind of look nice. I don't know, whatever. I just want to play Disgaea and this is the easiest way for me to do it in a decent quality manner. Though, if you guys are looking to pick this one up, I'd actually say wait just a little while. Let's see how bad this is, because we already we already know that this is a bad port, owing to the fact that, you know, all of the new features that they promised don't work. Um, yeah, no, apart from that, we'll figure it out. Okay, so first and foremost, I don't have much money, but I might as well buy some equipment, yada, 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 yada. We already know about all these things. It's, it's the Rosen Queen store. I'm going into this with the slight expectation that a lot of you know. One, two, three, four, ugh, god, this looks terrible. The devil do I buy? Oh, right. He sells armor and use items, and this is the weapon shop. There we go. Okay. Um, I've already seen that uh, NIS America has uh, has put up a posting being like, yeah, we're working on it. We're working on fixing it. And let's see. What does four mean? Okay, that's not it. Select? No, here we go. Okay. Uh, let's go back for a second. What kind of what kind of equipment does he have? So he's got a sword and seal. I want to check Lahara. What kind of weapons is he good with? He's a rank for everything. Oh God, those sprites are terrible. Here, uh, can you guys see the the mouse note? Whatever. Like there's little white outlines around the fist, the sword, the spear. The oh God, wow. This is actually like. As far as HD porting goes, this is one of the worst I've seen in a very long time. Um, like, this is truly and terribly bad. Alright, so we could go sword. Uh, what do I want to do? Last time I did fist. I could do sword, I could do spear, I could do bow. Looks like we only get one weapon, I think. What's she good with? Spears, axes. Oh, interesting. She's not like a gun user or anything. So she's currently got a spear. Uh, fuck, I don't know. Whatever, we got a common sword, common spear. Sword moves are pretty good in this game. I kind of want to go fist, though. Honestly. Oh, right, I forgot. And the innocents are, like, a completely different shindig, too. So attack 13, 8, 10, 4. 15. Okay. Really, this interface is magical.
We'll have Laharl punch people. Close enough, let's get out of here. Have you saved yet? Yes, I've saved. Press 4. It doesn't even recognize that I'm using a controller. That's sad. Alright, whatever. Uh, gatekeeper. We know these things. Yeah, I'm going into this with the expectation that a lot of you guys have seen Disgaea 5 before. And if you haven't, well, uh, I'm just, I'm just gonna be skipping over a lot of the basics because... I know them. I'm not gonna skip this just story for this, now, just because. Time for a little warm up. I feel a little rusty. I do like the HD art, for, uh, like HD character art though. That looks really nice. Uh, never mind. Wow, that actually looks kind of garbage. The outlines on Laharl are like really weird and JPEGy, almost. Whatever. This it still looks nice. Ah, Prince, we've got company. How convenient. Stray demons, huh? Allow me, Prince. You may be a little out of practice after your long slumber. Don't worry, I came prepared. Come on, pretty squad! Get your butts out here! What do you think of this pretty squad I hired? They're my loyal servants. They'll do anything I say. Are you sure about that? See? They're loyal! Does it make sense to beat up your allies before a battle? Anyways, I think we've made those demons wait long enough already. Hey, you're right. How nice of them to be so patient. Yeah, that's considerate of them. To show my appreciation, I'll only beat them half to death. You're so kind. If I were you, I'd beat them all the way to death. C kind Stop that! That word gives me goosebumps! Damn it! I take it back! I'm gonna beat them all the way to death! Hmm, he's still a kid. So quick-tempered. It looks like carrying out my plan will be a lot easier than I thought. Hmm? You say something! Oh, nothing, nothing at all. So, what are your orders, Prince? You do remember how to fight, right? All right, the tutorial. Freaking, I know how to fight in Disgaea. Okay, so we selected. No, oh god, whoa, god, those pretty portraits are terrifying. Holy shit, that is unnerving. I ha 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 ha. Like, I love me some printies, but man, they, the, those AD, HD portraits give me the willies. Like, Laharl, you know, he looks, yeah, I mean, he's just Laharling. And, you know, Etna, Etna's Etna. And then the printies are like, I don't like it. Alright, yeah, I'm definitely sticking with the PC version. If there's no Etna mode, then obviously I'm gonna do other things. Uh, like, load up the... PSP version, cheat a bunch and go through the campaign that way or something like that. I don't know. Um, but for the time being, we're just gonna stick with the... There's no skip tutorial button. It drives me insane. Um, for the time being, uh, Laurel's dead. <laughs> oh, why do I have to be the one to do this? I'm the next overlord for crying out loud. As an example of something not to do. Only an idiot would rush straight into the enemy alone. Uh, to the enemy alone. You made me do it. Characters killed in battle, like our prince here, can be revived by paying hell to the castle's hospital. Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> Man, I didn't. It wasn't even this bad in Phantom Brave, which I still need to get back to, but I just don't have time for. All right, so it looks like we're good. Yeah, I, I, I could skip past the story if I wanted to. Um. Wow, 
Is there a way to speed that up at all? Friendly effect, enemy effect. Sort of. There's no way to... Cursor movement speed. Key mode. I don't know. I don't... I don't know what key mode or cursor mode does. Whatever. Okay. Uh... So I will rename all of our characters in a bit. I do not remember the characters moving this slowly. Yeah, after going from 5 to this, it feels a little rough around the edges. Not gonna lie. Alright, let's bring Dandelion out. Uh, let's bolster here. Actually... We'll just do it this way. Oh wow, those sound effects are quiet. I'll have to turn them back up again. I had them down low because, uh... I had them down low with the expectations that they were going to be loud. Turns out that is not true. Alright, whatever. Uh, let's bring these printies back. So we've got Whitney and Dandelion. Wow, printies move far, apparently. Alright, well, let's see if I can get a team attack here. Nope! There are no team attacks with these printies. The they also do, like, zero damage. This is super di disappointing, honestly. Well, whatever. We win anyway. So it doesn't matter. I forgot how good the good and, like, goofy the music in Disgaea 1 was. Because, uh, Disgaea 5 had weird music. Oh, shoot. Right, we can't do the, like, lift attacks and stuff. Ah, uh, Egern, Winnie. Oh, wow, the, the font is even squashed. You can really tell with, like, Winnie and Cecilia, it just feels like it's been squashed down to fit in. Ugh. God, this is the ugliest port. Like, fire, wind, and ice uh, got ported over, but, like, the... Oh, wow. I, I don't have words here. There we go. Some team attacks. See, those portraits, like, the old portraits look really good and kind of creepy. The new ones, the printies just have tiny fucking eyes and it's weird. I don't like it. Alright, whatever. Battle Basics 2. Oh. Okay, so this is about throwing. I should have skipped, should have skipped this, this tutorial. Uh, because now it's going to teach me about throwing. <sighs> okay. Yeah. Uh, I should have skipped this one. Unfortunately, we can't just quit out or anything like that. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Yeah, so, I guess if you've never played a Disgaea game before, or never seen one before, honestly, I would truly recommend go watch my Disgaea 5 playthrough. Uh, it's probably going to be a little bit smoother because it seems like this port's a little bit garbage. A little bit lot garbage. I don't know. Um, it'll probably improve as we go along here. But uh, there there are definitely some, like, small amounts of, like, that I don't like too much. Uh, don't pay attention to the tutorial too much and don't worry about me, like, skipping past it. There's no plot in here. Just, like, a little bit of banter back and forth about Lil Harl being angry about being thrown. I don't know. Okay, there we go. Now we play. Um, let's see. Now we could... Oh, hey. That's actually pretty slick. Now we could throw people. But, like, don't care. Oh, right. I think there's a button I press to make people move faster. It's a uh, triangle. Nope. That is false. Apparently. Okay, well, let's murder this guy. Okay, that did not work as well as I wanted it to. That's okay. Let's just bring the whole party out and we'll just wait for the next enemies to come. I know this is supposed to be like a throwing tutorial. I don't care. I'll just beat the tar out of them. It's not like there's a requirement to throw. It's just a suggestion. Ish. Okay. Might as well try and max out as many team attacks as I can possibly do at all times. I actually really do like the old pixel art that went into the that went into these characters. I think they look really nice. Um like I'm not 
I don't know. I'm not too heartbroken that they didn't come up with, like, new HD sprites. Just because, like, ultimately, I don't really even care about HD on the, on, on character sprites, ever. It only bothers me because the, uh... It only bothers me because the... Uh, the user interface is such a such a crapshoot for like whether or not it's HD like the character portraits for the team attacks uh, I, I'm kind of on the wall about that one, but like this freaking the pretty portrait ah! <laughs> Or like the level HP SP MV JM and like the letters next to it like the 15 What the one has a much thicker black outline than the 15 does it honestly it literally looks like somebody um, went into Disgaea 1's, like, original sprite sheets and just photoshopped them out into individual transparent PNGs and then used them as such that way. Which honestly boggles my mind a little bit. I guess it works, but, like, oh, that is not how, it, that is not how you game design. That is not how you HD port. I mean, just screw it. Make your own assets. If you're going to be reselling this for 20 bucks, you might as, you might as well do it at least halfway right. Or something. I don't know. Uh, that's my general opinion. Oh, right. End turn. Um, I'm still going to play through this one. I don't know how much I'm going to do on the end game, but, like, the main plot is enjoyable enough. And, like, the last time I played Disgaea, uh, Disgaea 1, was... Oof. Um... I want to say it was back in 2007? Might have been even as early as like 2005 or something like that. It's been a long time since I've watched any... Or not watched. Uh, since I've played a Disgaea game. And... Oh, cool. I can't move him. And it... I, it feel... Well, not any Disgaea game. Uh, since I played Disgaea 1. And it feels good to be playing it again. Uh, now some of you are probably wondering, uh, and I should probably get this out of the way. Uh, for those of you that watched Disgaea 5, and you're wondering why I haven't gotten the, like, true ending yet? The reason why I haven't gotten the true ending yet, I don't have time! It is, uh, are you the... Oh, you're the Item World Gateway Center. Where's the... Where's the hospital? You're the hospital? No, you're the... Oh, right. Don't care. Who heals? You heal? Netherworld Hospital. Okay, I was looking for a priestess. I thought she was supposed to be the samurai. I don't know. Whatever. Let's get treated. Cost money. Thanks. Uh, let's buy some monster weapons, come to think of it. I also want to see if I can rename some of my dudes. And if I can't, well, sadness. Uh, let's just do the crab pincers. There we go. I don't know if they had weapons or not, but this way the printies will be at least halfway decent. Actually, I want to check this. Status. Winnie. Uh, cannot register weapons. Oh, you know what? We probably need Planaire. Yeah. So until we get the assembly, I don't think we can rename any of the printies. Which is a shame, because I'd like to do that. Alright, last one's Geo... I think the last one's Geo Effect? There could be more... Oh shit, I was supposed to skip the story. Whatever. Okay, so some of you might be wondering, seeing as I... Did both play through, uh, I did Disgaea 5 and started, uh, Phantom Brave. You know, where are they? Uh, so for Disgaea 5, I just simply don't have enough time to grind all of my characters to have perfectly maximum stats. Uh, I simply don't. I have 20 games coming out in the next three weeks. Yeah. <laughs> and chances are I'm gonna try and cover all of them to some degree or another. Obviously, some games are going to go the way of the Dodo really fast and... Others won't, so trying to grind out off-camera a bunch of things is simply impossible. And doing it on-camera, most people aren't going to watch it, so it's not worth my, like, time and effort. Um, this goes with Xenoblade Chronicles X, come to think of it, uh, as well. But the other, the other thing that I point out, why throw it? Just break it, you... Oh, I get it. I see. Yeah, whatever. Um, but so, for Phantom Brave, I just simply don't have time. I'll come back to it. Like, a lot of my series I always intend to finish, and I'd love to finish. But, like, today alone I'm putting out so many videos 
And this is like the day I just got back from uh, PAX East. Not PAX East. MAGFest. So everything just got... Uh, everything's just gotten out of hand. Oh, and I've not had time to properly record everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know. But, uh... Yeah, so that that's what's happened to Disgaea 5. Someday I'll go back to it, probably when I move out and have some time to sit down and grind while watching TV or something like that. But literally all of my time is spent recording, rendering, recording, rendering, recording, rendering. And I don't have time to fire up, like, a PS4. And chances are that's what's gonna happen with this game, too. There is, like, a fairly substantive... Um, endgame? Blah, hello, this is different. Uh, for this game, and I'm not entirely sure how I'm gonna do it. Okay, uh... So this is extra HP, EXP, and hell. Which one's on the blue? So... We get extra EXP and money, as long as they're on red tiles. Now we can switch it to blue, but that'll also give everybody... Oh, I see. Uh, eh. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna keep all of our characters on the blue tiles. I could do the geo panel thing, but that's dumb, and why would I do that? Uh, so we're just gonna use use and abuse the panels here for the time being. Um, actually, I'm gonna bring him back. I'm gonna send Laharl after Samuel here. Ooh, that is a nice portrait. I like the new monster portraits. They look really good. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Oh, nice to be playing this game again. And this one might go the way of the Dodo if not not enough people watch it. That's always kind of the case. Like, I'd, I'd love to do it any other way. Oh, hey, special. He actually has triple strike now. Cool. Uh, she doesn't have anything yet. Oh, that's fine. Uh, probably too many combo attacks, honestly. Uh, but I'll, I'll give it an honest try to get through as much of this game as possible. What I'll probably end up doing is just, like, turbo level, like, one one or two characters, leave the game on easy, and more or less just plow through the plot like a crazy person. Uh, just because that'll probably be a lot easier for everyone involved, instead of me trying to take the, like, hard route and doing, like, crazy grinding. But, uh, like, for the, for the end game for this game, chances are what's gonna happen is I'm going to, uh, I'm probably gonna find some kind of, uh, hack that makes it so it goes a hell of a lot faster. Because I, I like grinding in some games. Other games, just can't stand it. Uh, and like, I love grinding in Disgaea, but again, time problems are such an issue. Yeah, going fist is a good idea. I like me some fists. Okay. Fortunately, the rest of my characters are garbage. And I bought them new equipment so they wouldn't be totally useless. I guess they did some damage there. Like, they actually killed that guy. Congrats. I think this guy might actually be able to get the kill, too. Yeah. Uh, using the combo meter is actually pretty important here. I think I might lose a printy. Nope. Did not. Oh, I'm okay with that. Uh, let's see. So level two, level two, level two, level two. Okay. Well, in that case, I'm just gonna stack the house for combo attacks. It spreads out the EXP a little bit. And I, like, part of my consideration here is I actually wouldn't mind having, like, a whole party of, uh, pretties playing through the entire game and have that be the only people. But chances are I'm actually just gonna have it be, like, Laharl and, like, just the main characters. But mostly the Harl. Starting to get the hang of things again. Uh, now we can go get some allies at the Dark Assembly. Awesome! Okay, tutorial for the Dark Assembly. We can vote on things. We need mana. We can get new characters. Oh, shoot. If I remember right, creating characters requires mana again. Well, that's fine. Okay, summon assembly. So we can... Someone with Laharl, seeing as these literally the only one with mana. Okay, hey! So Winnie, Yearn, Dandelion. I have no idea if there's any, like, substantive differences between any of these guys. So I guess you, promotion exam. Oh! I forgot that was a thing. Alright, we're gonna change. What? Change name. Who will address the assembly? Arden?
What the fuck? But I wanted a name. Oh, change name NP. Oh, I just I just changed the uh, the healer's name. <laughs> All right, there we go. Got it now. Uh, <laughs> I was really confused for a second there. You guys know who this is, this one is. Hopefully it fits. It fit on the last one, so I'm hoping... Yeah! Alright, so now we got Grand Slam Man. I'll figure out the other ones later. Okay, we can also do Promotion Exam. Don't want to do that. Delete Character. Create Character. Okay, that's nothing. So let's do Create Character with, with Laharl. So you do monsters, number killed. Right, there's like different skulls. So this is what this is what the originals looked like. Or if they got all weird in um in Disgaea 5. Okay, uh let's pick a character that's good with probably swords. See, there is no difference between either of these, honestly. Alright, let's go with her. And let's go with incompetent. And we're gonna name here her. Uh, let's see. Oh. Mo swords. Gotcha. Alright. Oh, right. We get one, S one SP. I guess we'll just put it into attack power. Done. Alright. So I think that's going to be the ex Oh, right. We should probably make a, um... We should probably also make a... Can I? We should probably also make some kind of spellcaster. Curative magic. Uh, which one has a higher resistance? It has the same resistance. We'll go with her then. Good for nothing. Ability bonus, minus five, minus five though. Nah, we'll leave that for later. Uh, I'll get some spellcasters. Have you gone to the hospital? Blah, 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 Actually, you know what? Thank you, zombie. Okay, now I think her name's Pam, but... Don't know if she noticed. Oh, did I get a did I get a prize for that? No. Then who leveled up? I have no idea. I give up. A lot of things have changed since the days of Disgaea One, and it's a little unfamiliar. But I'll get the swing of things. Um, and you know whatever. It's fun. I like it. I can't wait to see. Well, it's not that I can't wait to see more. I've already beaten this game. I I know exactly what happens, which is weird. I'm not used to that. Uh, but, you know, it's been almost a decade, so I, I'm forgetting to. So anyway, uh, I guess a couple of things. Obviously, PC port's a little bit weird. I'll probably try and turn on the HD, uh, environment art when they fix it back up again so it doesn't look like utter garbage. Um, and, I don't know. Apart from that, I guess if you guys are looking into getting to the PC port and you don't have any other options, it's not a bad choice. Uh, otherwise, I'd actually say get like an emulator and play the PSP version or the DS versions because it's going to be about the same, but without any of the issues. Uh, I guess apart from that, I don't know. It's it's okay. It's just fun to be playing a uh, Disgaea game again, and I'll start plowing through it really fast. I think because uh, I'll just do some grinding and then we'll just churn through the story. We'll see how it goes from there. So, I guess if you guys liked this episode in any way, shape, or form, leave me a like, helps more than you know, and lets me know that you want to see more Disgaea 1. And, uh, if you want to see more, hit subscribe, because I'm going to give it the old college try. I really do want to beat Disgaea 1 again, both for my channel and because I love Disgaea games. So, with that, I'll see you guys in the next episode, and as always, thanks for watching.